for Paul we arrived at Gig Lane. Obviously, thoughts after the abandoned game on Saturday versus AFC Liverpool, but with their key craft as injury. Uh, the good news is that injuries weren't severe, um, so to start with, can we just get your thoughts on the game on Saturday? Yeah, it's um, it's great news that their keepers are fitting well and hopefully re recovers and goes through the concussion protocols well and um, so we can get back playing again. But I thought, you know, and yet another occasion this season where we've played ever so well, um, but switched off in some key moments or maybe not quite committed to the, the way we're asking them to play out of possession and, you know, giving up too many chances um, and that's what's cost us ultimately you know I think when we're 3-1 up 4-2 up then we should be seeing games out and we would no one would be disputing we deserve to win them um, but yeah we let, we've let teams back into games a little bit too easily so I'm hoping tonight um, yeah, we knock that on the head. So moving on to the game today it goes without saying that this is a game that everyone within the club has been looking forward to. From a management point of view have you been trying to emphasise to the players that it's simply another game or yeah, I think we haven't really spoken about it. I know we've been, it's been on a lot of people's minds for obvious reasons. Um, but look, it, it's an occasion, isn't it? You know, we, we, we'd be silly not to recognise that it's a, a big moment and a big opportunity for people. And, you know, I said to them before, they, hopefully they embrace that. Hopefully the supporters embrace that. Um, you know, it might be, uh, you know, might, might be a while till we get this opportunity again if, if us and Berry aren't in the same league. Um, so. Yeah, we, we've got to make the most of it, but then use it into a really positive thing and, and draw inspiration and energy and enthusiasm from the occasion um, and, and be brave and stand up to it um, rather than let, us, let it pass us by. So I hope they're fully in the moment. I hope they remember it for the right reasons because they've delivered a really good performance and um, yeah, the rest of it doesn't, doesn't affect them. I don't think it will. We're used to playing in front of big crowds, certainly from season one, and hopefully we will do again in the future and um, our players tend to be big game players and I'm really looking forward to, to seeing that tonight. So looking towards the opposition, they've obviously appointed the new manager yesterday who's in charge for the team for the first time today. Has that impacted your preparations at all or changed anything? Um, yeah, we, we know a little bit about how the new managers played in previous clubs and we know how they very have played the last couple of games so we'll just you know see how they set up from this day one and We've got our plan and you know, we'll stick to that as much as we possibly can do and then hopefully exploit areas we think that, that they can be exploited in and um, if we need to tweak things as we go along we will do but you know, we've prepared in the same way that we normally would and it, you know, hopefully um, it affects Barry more than us in terms of the new manager being here and, uh, and what they're trying to do um, um, under his guidance. Thanks Paul, good luck tonight. Thank you.